Bengaluru-based startup Ultraviolet Automotive recently unveiled the production spec battery pack that will power its upcoming F77 electric bike. The pre-bookings for the electric bike has already and customers interested to get their hands on the bike can book the bike online by paying 10,000 rupees. The electric motorcycle is slated to launch on November 24th this year and Ultraviolet is expected to price the bike somewhere between 3 rupees minus 4 lakh. Talking about the electric bike, the company said that the entire chassis of the bike is redesigned to incorporate the new battery pack which is now fixed and heavier than before and the new frame is two times stiffer than the old frame. The electric bike now gets refining step-down transmission for better durability and reduced noise levels. The bike also gets a redesigned redesigned swing arm while the original swing arm was a milled unit. The bike now also gets a pre-load adjustable USD fork and a mono shock. As mentioned before, the electric bike will get riding modes and three levels of regenerative braking that will affect the range and performance. Talking about the new battery pack, the new battery pack is fixed, larger and packs more lithium-ion cells. The company says that the decision to switch to a fixed battery pack was taken in the interest of improving the range of the bike. The battery pack now uses 21,700 lithium-ion cells as opposed to the 18,650 cells in the prototype and this translates to a usable capacity of 10.5 kWh and which makes the F77's battery size the largest of any electric two-wheeler in India. As mentioned before, the battery now is fixed and the cells are encased in an aluminium case making it heavier by a hefty 50 kg. Along with the battery update, the electric bike also gets three levels of regenerative braking and riding modes that will affect the range. Most importantly, the motorcycle now gets a claimed range of 307 km, which is the highest for any electric two-wheeler in India. The company will also provide multiple charging options along with charging infrastructure, details of which will be announced at the launch. The company will be opening its first experience center in Bengaluru and will be expanding to other cities over the next 12 months. The company says it has received over 70,000 bookings from 190 countries and it also plans to begin exports to other markets in the next 24 months.